Hello, discoverers and wanderers! Welcome back to our channel! And for those of you who are new to our channel, we are Joanne and Nico, discoverers and wanderers from Manila. Most recently, we spent our holidays in Europe. At dahil marami sa inyo ang nagtatanong ng kung ano nga bang mga requirements at paano mag-apply ng visa for Europe, we decided to create a video to guide you sa application process. By the way guys, if you haven't seen our Europe vlogs, you can check out our Europe playlist where we discovered and wandered around Austria, Switzerland, Liechtenstein, and Czech Republic. So ano nga ba yung kailangan na visa to visit Europe? For most European countries, you will be needing Schengen Visa. So, ano nga ba ang Schengen Visa Wanderers? A Schengen Visa is an entry permit for short and temporary visit to countries in the Schengen area. This includes 27 countries na pasok sa Schengen area like Belgium, Austria, Czech Republic, Denmark, and other European countries. And here in the Philippines, you can apply your Shenzhen Visa via VFS Global. Sila na pala yung magpa-process ng application nyo to your corresponding European embassies. And for our most recent trip, we decided to get a Shenzhen Visa via Swiss Embassy. And we'll take you through a step-by-step -step process. Okay, Wanderers, let's go to the VFS Global website. Here you will find everything you need to apply for a Shenzhen Visa. Of course, your first step always is to identify your visa type. There are three major visa types such as tourist, business, and visiting family and friends. Siyempre, let's select tourist kasi tourist naman yung visa ang applyan natin. And here you will see all the relevant information about the tourist visa. You can also see the visa fees, documents required, photo specifications, processing time, and downloadable forms. And now that we have identified the appropriate visa type, let's begin our application. Let me show you the checklist for tourist visa. So first, you need a duly completed, dated, and signed application form that you can download on this link. Click the Shenzhen visa application form and choose English German. Once you have downloaded the application form, you just need to fill it up with your personal details, employment history, travel plans, and then print and sign the document. Next would be your passport. It must be valid for at least 6 months after the planned stay abroad. Don't forget to photocopy the first two pages of your passport and also the back page as well as copies of visas from your past travels, such as Shenzhen visas, UK visa, US visa, and Canadian visas for the past 10 years. You will also be needing two passport size photos with a light background. Paste one photo on the application form and do not staple. You can also check this link on the photo guidelines. Next is flight reservation. Round trip air travel and if applicable, proof of intra Shenzhen flight, train itinerary or car rental. Take note wanderers na hindi nyo naman kailangan bumili ng ticket ahead of time. May mga airlines na papayagan kayong mag-reserve ng ticket even without payment. Or pwede naman kayong mag-book ng fully refundable or free cancellation which I think is available sa mga business class or first class. Another requirement wanderers is the travel insurance which should have a minimum coverage of 30,000 euros or 1.8 million pesos. Here's the complete list of accredited insurance providers which are accepted for Shenzhen visa application. The coverage and price varies, but for us, we chose standard insurance, which is one of the fastest and most affordable option. Just go to their website, scroll down to Travel Protect, then get a code for Travel International. You can see here that the coverage is 2.5 million pesos which is perfect for Shenzhen visa application. Now you just have to answer this form. Package type is individual. Select the destinations. For example, Switzerland, Austria, and Czech Republic. Select the date of departure. Date of arrival age, choose Worldwide Protect. Now you see that the policy costs 2,703 pesos, which is a pretty good price. Then click Buy Now. Fill up your personal details. 
and settle the payment. Once your payment is confirmed, Wanderers, mag-e-email na agad sa inyo si Standard Insurance ng policy nyo. Sobrang bilis nito, Wanderers, ha? like within minutes lang. Next stop is the accommodation and itinerary. Proof of accommodation for each night of the entire planned trip and your detailed itinerary. Here, you can just print your booking confirmation from Agoda, Booking.com, or Airbnb, and also your detailed itinerary. For financial means, you will need to get a stamped and signed original bank certificate of current account balance and bank statements showing account activity for the past 6 months. If for some reason your bank statements doesn't span 6 months, for example, lumipat kayo ng bagong banko, or you keep your savings into different or multiple banks, just submit what is available and then provide a written explanation letter when you submit your requirements. If employed, you have to provide your Certificate of Employment, which shows your position, date of hiring, and salary. Make sure that you also include your company contact details and attach a proof of approved leaves. This could be a letter from your boss or extracted approved leaves from the system. You would also need to provide your ITR. If this is not available, you can also provide a written explanation when you submit your requirements in the Visa Application Center. And since I'm a housewife wanderers, si Nico lang yung nag-provide ng mga documents na to from his employer. He just submitted a letter of support for my application. And if you are self-employed wanderers, you need to provide your proof of business registration, your ITR, and business financial statement. For students, you need to submit your proof of enrollment, leave of absence, and a copy of your student ID. If married, syempre kailangan natin magpasa ng marriage certificate. For minors, a notarized consent letter, proof of financial support, ESWD clearance, and copies of the guardian's passports. And then for non-Filipino applicants with residency status here in the Philippines, you just need to submit a copy of the residence permit. Wanderers, now that we have completed the checklist, let's book an appointment. Let's go back to the VFS Global website, click Book an Appointment, and Book Now. Click I don't have an account, and simply register. Once you are logged in, choose the Visa Application Center, Appointment Category, which is Short Stay, and subcategory, which is tourist, just enter your personal details. Then choose an appointment, date, and time. You can also choose additional services for an additional fee, but we will skip this for now. And then confirm the appointment. You will receive an appointment confirmation that you also have to print prior to your appointment. Okay, Wanderers, once you have confirmed your appointment at na-print yun na rin lahat ng required documents, next step natin, of course, is to pay your visa fee. For us, we personally paid our visa fee doon sa Visa Application Center at the time of our appointment. This is us in the Visa Application Center. Bags are not allowed inside but you can use the free lockers before entering. Don't forget to bring a pen since there are additional forms to fill up. It took us around 30 to 45 minutes to complete the process. This includes filling up the additional forms, taking of visa pictures, and biometrics collection. Then after a week, we received a notification that our passports are ready for pickup. Wanderers, pinigay na natin yung receipt para sa visa natin. Maghihintay na lang daw tayo dito sa labas. Shenzhen Visa Approved! And that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Sana makatulong tong visa application guide video natin sa pagkuha nyo ng Shenzhen Visa. At kung may mga questions pa kayo, comment down below. Pipilitin natin sagutin lahat yan. Thank you guys for watching again at give us a thumbs up kung nagustuhan nyo tong video na to and please, please do subscribe to our channel. Until our next adventure, Wanderers! Good night!